Hey y'all, I was coming to you today because of, I think, well, what did I just do a haul on, on my um, NASA Naturals yesterday? Um, but also yesterday I got in the mail my Onion Handmade. Now that's something I've been using for, let's see, probably under, man, two and a half years? Maybe about two and a half years. Um, I, I first saw it actually in the Essence magazine. They had like a whole lot of uh, natural hair stuff and hair care and stuff like that. Um, um, and I think probably later on sometime I'll go into why I use natural hair care on my permed hair. Um, because it's not just natural hair care for me. Um, it's uh, the way I live and stuff. So I'll go into that later on. But um, I was running out of my onion handmade. Um, and I was probably running out because... I'm not the only person in the house to use it. My husband uses it. Uh, we don't have kids, so I don't know how it works on kids' hair. Um, but my hair is permed, and I use these products. And my husband's hair is natural. Um, and he's half Haitian, half Dominican. So he has uh, really curly hair, nice thick hair. Um, but he loves the stuff. Um, so I'll go ahead and tell you what I got um, from my first, I guess. So... Um, I get juices and berries. I'm like right here on my bottle that I have now. Um, I use this on my dry hair when it, when it's dry or um, right after I wash it just to give it a little moisture. It has natural minutes in it. So um, when mo most of the time when I spray this, either I'm about to get in the shower. So when I do take a shower, it can lock in all that moisture that is going to get in the air. Um, so that's that. Um, it smells like cool... I want, I want to say Kool-Aid or something like that. It smells like, uh, I don't know, like I, Tropical Punch or something. I don't know. But this stuff is the bomb. And this time I went ahead and got two of these because my husband uses the mess. Like he must use like every day and just go, goes in on it. So I got two of these, one for his bathroom, one for mine. Um, I got the Shine and Define, which I'm almost out of. Actually, it's over there sitting on the computer. Uh, but I'm almost out of that because I use this uh, for my hair. I use it, like, on my edges um, underneath pretty much for, like, a, a gel setting because I don't like brown gel. I don't like any kind of gel that's going to hold my hair down too tough or whatever. I really just like it so I can still put my hands in it. And at the end, they'd be able to brush it back and it'll still lay back nice. It don't have to be just flat to my head. It just needs to be able to be pulled back. And this does it. This smells like a... Um, like a pina colada type smell. Yeah, like a pina colada type smell. That's the consistency. It's really a, like a gelatin type consistency, if you will. Smells really good. Um, I only have to use a little bit of it. However, my husband discovered I had it and went buck wild on it. I don't know what he was doing. He Sometimes he pulls his hair back in ponytail. And when I tell you his hair is thick and curly, it's about this long. I mean, you can braid it. I don't know. I don't know what the world. I, I couldn't tell you to this day what he did with it. I think he tried to put a ponytail. And the crazy part is, once he do all that, he puts that uh, stocking cap upside his head along with a baseball cap. I don't know. But he loves it. Um, so I let him have the remainder of that last one. <laughs> and bought a new one for myself. But I'm pretty sure he been took over this one too. So, no, never mind that. Um, I got the Onion Handmade Hairdo. Now, this is new to me. I'm not sure if it's brand new to the company. I think it is. I know it's not too old to the company, but it's not too new either. I went ahead and picked this up because I have tried um, probably just oils. Um, then I tried, oh man, I have to get the name of it. But I have a another oil in there that's... Um, like a moisturizer, hair moisturizer in there. That works pretty well, but the rest of the hairline is terrible. Matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead and do a review on that come later on. Um, my hair does not love it. And then once when I went and looked out on YouTube just to check out other reviews, people with natural hair did not love it. It was horrible to their hair, and I don't like it. Only thing I do like is their oil and the moisturizer. So I'm going to do a review on that later. I'm not talking about the one you have made, but this is the other product, and I'll let you know about that later. Um, however, I did sample this thing out yesterday. Um, in fact, I think I might spray my hair first just a little bit, put a little spray on it. Um, stepped out the shower, and I put this stuff on I love it. 
I love it. Um, I don't like pink oil moisturizer, so I got away from that like years and years ago. Probably like almost ten years ago, nine, ten years ago. I got away from that. But I absolutely love this. Um, I will continue first. I did get it in the big bottle. Um, let's see. This is the 16 ounce, so this is the biggest one they had. I went and got it in this. I'm glad I did. My husband loves it also. I gave him a little bit to sample yesterday before we went out to the circus. And he loves it. Um, he still threw his little hat and his net on, so oh well. But he absolutely loved it. Um, and for some reason, I think he's going to come back for this. So I think I'm going to put him a little something in the bottle and see how it works with that. Hopefully, he starts to learn a little bit goes a long way because it do. A little bit will go a long way. Um, but that's all I bought from um, the Onion Handmade. Now, what I do still have from Onion Handmade, and I bought this like a few months back, and I'm scared it's going to go bad, um, is the whipped pudding. Whipped pudding. Um, if anybody else out there have this, y'all know that it's hard. Um, I used to, you probably see a little strand of hair in it. It's hard. I, I keep it in my refrigerator because I'm just... I, I was using it in my hair uh, because I don't use hair grease. I really just use oils, um, and I don't put that much oils in my hair. But I use this, like, on my scalp because I know I read somewhere where you could. But it's just too thick. I can't put it on my hair shaft because it's too, um, it, it leaves my hair stiff. I did try to warm it up and um, put it on my skin, but I still think it's too thick. I'm thinking about adding some kind of oil or something to it. Um, if anybody else had that problem with this, let me know um, what you did to correct that problem because it smells good. It, it smells like cocoa, um, which I have cocoa in the raw, so I mean, I use I use it myself with shea butter, but this seems like a really thick and really creamy, and I don't know how to dummy this thing down. So if y'all know something, let me know. Um, darn it, what did I do with it? Okay, well, I was going to tell y'all, I, I had it here. I must have been reading mess with it. Uh, well, it came in a flat rate box, too. But um, they have now, like, a little yellow piece of paper that on the back it has, like, different little products that they have, like the uh, like the bar, the funk, whatever, and um, this stuff. They, ha they have this on the back, and it tells you how you can use it. Um, I wish I still had it here, but I don't know what I did with it. Now, also, normally, when I order the onion handmade, it comes with, like, those little... Hard candies, if anybody ever ordered it, come with like little hard candies that's really good. This time it came with one candy. And I ate it. <laughs> I was looking forward to getting this box. Cause, and I, I mean, they're probably like little cheap candies you can go buy anywhere. However, normally when I get my on your handmade box, I look forward to these little candies for some reason. I don't know. Being who, y'all. Um, yeah, if you have any um, advice on how to use that, um, that whipped, what is it, whipped pudding? Let me know. I just, just don't want it to go bad or whatever. I don't want to go bad. Or I might just end up giving it to, giving it away to somebody, you know, that may enjoy using it. But it's it's too thick for my scalp. And I'm not sure if it's because I got permed hair. But then again, um, I thought I heard somebody else say it was way too thick for them as well. So, anyways, let me know, y'all. Um, that's it. I could have sworn I had something else for you. But, whatever. Holla.